Okay, so this next segment in the agenda is going to be dedicated to a particular event that I went to uh, just last week, uh, probably like four or five days ago. Um, it was a fundraiser uh, for this uh, organization that calls themselves Team Teal uh, 365. And they are an organization um, that works with, uh, you know, preventing... Uh, like domestic violence, uh, rape, things like that. Um, I'm not going to go into too much detail about it right now because I have spoken with the founders of the organization. I'm actually going to interview them uh, at a later time. So um, if you if you guys recall when I did the video about the vagina monologues, this was the organization that kind of helped get that going. Um, so... You know, my uh, my classmate uh, Claire invited me to this fundraising event, so I attended. It was uh, it was at a place called Hamburger Mary's, which I had never heard of or been to before. Because there's, you know, I mean, I'm still kind of new to Milwaukee, so I haven't been to a lot of the places, uh, you know, in the area. So again, like I said, with uh, you know, like going to to Anime Central, it's like I'm trying to um, be more uh forward about like going to things that i'm invited to because i mean if they're nice enough to invite me i should at least check it out um so i went and it was uh it w the 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 fundraiser itself was a series of uh bingo games um you know playing the classic game bingo um i didn't actually play i i mean i bought tickets for it but um you know i didn't my my goal that night wasn't to you know walk out with a bunch of goodies because they had they had some uh, pretty nice prizes um not just for bingo but there was a, a raffle drawing as well um but uh despite the fact i still walked out with uh a couple items including this pretty sweet shirt um which is from the sprecher brewery which i'm not familiar with um but um they are a brewery in in Milwaukee. Um, I don't I don't know if I don't think they do alcoholic beverages. I might be wrong on that. Uh, it's just yet another thing I'm not, I'm not familiar with in the Milwaukee area. Um, but I got the shirt. I got this nice uh, uh, rubber bracelet, kind of promoting the uh, the Team Teal uh, name and so forth. Um, so I just wanted to kind of make a quick uh, isolated. Uh, segment of this of this episode just to just to talk about that and you know kind of spread the word because i mean they're they're still um i wouldn't say a small organization i mean i was actually really surprised and impressed at how well they pulled off this fundraiser because um in speaking with the the two women i mean it's just two women doing doing this right now and they this was their first fundraiser and they they packed the place. The place was completely packed with people supporting this. And I was, I was blown away. I thought this was like maybe their fifth, sixth, tenth fundraiser. It was their first one. So for them to, to be able to accomplish that with their first fundraiser is amazing. And, uh, you know, they're planning on obviously having another one, uh, in the near future, probably, I think like summertime or something like that. But, uh, I don't know for sure. Obviously, that's part of the reason why I wanted to set up an interview with them because I feel that what they're doing is really important. Um, I mean, it's a it's an easy thing to get behind. You can't. There's no arguing that you know the the, the things that they're trying to prevent are are in any way uh, like a good thing. You know, so um, I am very much looking forward to doing the interview. I don't know when that's going to happen. It's probably going to be. I don't know. I think at least for the moment, I'm looking at probably waiting until until the semester is over, um, just so that the schedules are uh, more open to line up and we can uh, take care of the interviews. So again, you know, just uh, keep your eyes on on the road to Japan dot com or you know watch the YouTube channel, and I will obviously uh, provide updates uh, for when those things start to happen. <laughs> 